Underwater blackouts can happen to anyone, even experienced ocean goers. That's the message from experts after several recent drownings in the islands. So what do professional and former free divers have to say about it? Bryce Moore found out. If you think hyperventilating raises oxygen levels in your blood, think again. Oahu's longest standing free diving instructor says it actually lowers carbon dioxide. So if you decrease the CO2, you will take away that urge to breathe. Uh, you will take away those contractions that you may get on your breath hold, which is not good. Without those contractions and an imbalance of CO2, your brain essentially doesn't recognize that your body needs a breath. So you're going to black out a lot sooner than you expected, making freediving really, really dangerous. And while not hyperventilating is a huge tip for freedivers, Koval says losing motor control and blacking out underwater simply can't be prevented, which is why diving with the one buddy up, one down rule is so important. You can only save these things. And uh, knowing how to properly save these things, one buddy is diving while the other person is on the surface. Once the diving buddy starts to come up, Koval says the person on the surface should get to an arm's length distance to where they'll appear. Then... Watching them for 30 seconds and give an OK sign. So this is what I'm doing as a safety diver to my diver after every single dive that they do. One retired medical doctor and former freediver tells me he had his own shallow water blackout in college, betting his friends that he could swim 100 meters underwater. I hyperventilated and I probably over hyperventilated. And on my last lap, fortunately, not in the middle of the pool, but on the last lap, I passed out and I was swimming unconsciously against the wall and my friends pulled me out. He was lucky enough that his friends were in arm's reach to pull him to safety and just wants others to not repeat his same mistake. I mean, I think it should be taught in the high schools and I think that would be, at least they would be aware of it, you know, um, to some degree. The nonprofit Free Dive Safe Hawaii, where Koval is an instructor, offers no cost free diving safety skills and techniques. We'll have a link to more information on KHON2.com. Bryce Moore, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.